These are the six things you should never, ever do on an airplane. Hey everybody, it's Jay Bear with another Jay Today where I give you a piece of my mind three minutes at a time live on location today in Bozeman, Montana. I'm actually at Bobcats Stadium, home of the Fighting Bobcats at Montana State in Bozeman, uh, doing some speaking for a coalition of University Alumni Association marketers. Great town, lots of fun, beautiful location. Uh, it took a couple flights to get out here from Indiana all the way to Montana and had an amazing experience uh, on the flight. And it got me thinking, you know, we beat up on airlines a lot. I certainly do on this show. I think all of us have kind of that story of an airline that went bad and the flight was late or the flight attendant was rude or everybody's got that bad airline story. But it got me thinking, how many bad passenger stories do airline professionals have? How many times do they sit around the break room and say, you couldn't believe this guy in 4D? So in that spirit, ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna tell you the six things that you should never ever do in a plane. Number one, I saw for the very first time, I should say heard for the very first time, just yesterday on my way out here to Bozeman, I was in seat 1A, a small plane, very front. Guy goes to the restroom, and I hear him actually recording voice messages to his wife using the voice recorder on his phone while he is actually in the bathroom. And he wasn't in there for just a few seconds, folks. It was a bit of a time span. If you're that busy that you have to actually record voice memos when in an airplane bathroom seated, you got to get some assistance. That's number one. Second thing you should never do on a plane, don't take your bulky jackets and take up everybody's overhead bin storage before everybody has their bags in. It's rude and it's unnecessary. If you're that cold, put your jacket on your lap. Number three, do not clip your fingernails in the plane. I see it actually fairly frequently, completely freaks me out. Not only is it gross, but it's also an annoying sound. Number four, and some people might uh, digress with me on this point, don't take off your socks on the plane. I don't want your yuck feet all over the armrest and the tray table and everywhere else. And you see it all the time. People like totally taking off their shoes and their socks. That's gross and totally unnecessary. The next thing you should do is don't bring smelly food on the plane. Like if you feel like you've got to bring your own snacks or you're running late and you got to bring some, that's fine. But you know what? You don't need like yellow curry on the plane, right? Get something that's a salad that's not going to like absolutely cause consternation for six rows forward and six rows backward. And the last thing, and this actually happened to me, and someday I'll tell you this whole story in a Jay Today video, do not bring your dog on the plane if you then let the dog out of its cage and it poops all over the plane. Those are my six things that you should absolutely never do on a plane. I hope you have some others that I have forgotten. Leave a comment on other things that you believe people should not do on a plane. And the very best ones, I'll give you a shout out in the next episode. Maybe I'll do a second video with, uh, with your suggestions. Today's Sprout Social shout out is from my friend DJ Waldo. DJ's fantastic guy, amazing community manager, email marketer, helps people with their careers now. Awesome, awesome guy. Uh, he is a fan of the University of Michigan, which is playing Indiana today. So today's shout out goes to DJ. Make sure you're following him in social media. As always, this show, even from Bozeman, is brought to you by Sprout Social, a terrific social media marketing tool that I use every day for my own social media, SproutSocial.com, and by Candidio. They make these videos a success. Uh, I just upload them on my phone. They do the rest. They can do the same for you, Candidio.com. Until tomorrow, this is Jay Bear from Bozeman, Montana. Thanks for watching.